Welcome Flip Clock fans. A member of uh, FlipClockFans.com forum had a question about a flip clock they recently bought. They were having trouble so that uh, on an hour, once the minutes moved over to say 23, the 10 had already changed over to 11. It happens on every hour. Well, and they also noticed there were two tiles for each hour, and that's normal for these Copal flip clocks. So as you watch, when you get to about 20 or 23, there, it's, it flipped here, but it's still 10. Now, then what they'll get probably right around 45, 445 is they're going to get that they're going to flip over to 11. I'm going to show you why that's not supposed to happen or what, what stops that from happening. So we're going to go to 12 here. So everything's going along just fine here. Both wheels are advancing slowly. You'll get the drop to the next tile. Now what's going to happen you have to look right here. There's a piece of metal here. It's a spring tab, very thin piece of metal, easily bent. What's just going to happen? That's going to catch that tile and stop it from falling. Now you'll see what just happened was the wheel here, where the 40 is, thickened, and it pushed that over, so that now about 40 or 45, that hour drops and is held in place by that tab. So all I'd have to do right now to get the condition this uh, member was talking about was just move that tab out of the way uh, or I couldn't, it's because of the thickening, that's right but if I could move that out of the way it would drop. Now what you're going to see when we get to 59 you can probably already see it up here there's a extension on the tab of 59 so the thick, uh, well the thickening stops at 59 the thickening stops at the wheel on 59 it just drops away and all that's left is that tab on 59 holding that piece of metal in as you can see right here that's the only thing holding that piece of metal in this tab is already dropped from this metal tine here which is holding back the three so when the 59 drops the two drops to the three and that's how it works now the question is can you fix that well the, the, the uh, question I have for you is does your clock have the metal piece and if so, it's likely bent. You can fix that. It is difficult. If it's missing altogether, that's almost impossible because you have to find the specific piece of metal. You'd almost have to buy another clock. I'm not saying it's, it's totally impossible, but these, you're not going to find this part. So good luck. Um, check your clock out. If you have any questions, come visit us at flipclockfans.com.